Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to actually be a vlogmas video. So I'm going to be vlogging for the first week of December. Today is actually the 30th of November. It's Monday and I have the day off. So I figured I would vlog while I have the day off because the next few days aren't gonna be that exciting. I'm gonna actually just go ahead and start getting ready. Um, I really just want these to be very uh, laid back um, like vlogs. I'm just gonna vlog my week and then um, put it all together. So today will be longer um, be just because I work the rest of the week and it I really won't be doing much of anything besides just working. Um, I do work 12 hour shifts, 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. So, and then I have um, my bosses in town from Atlanta. So it's probably going to be a really big um, and important busy week. So I won't probably be vlogging much for the rest of the week. Um, I'll try to get in videos here and there, but basically today I need to go to the mall. I need to return a few things um, at Old Navy. I ordered some stuff when they were having 50% off. I do have like a Banana Republic credit card. So I ordered a few things online, 50% off with my card, and I'm gonna go return a jacket and exchange a belt. So I do have wet hair because I'm gonna come home later and um, blow dry it. I just didn't wanna wait too long to go to the mall. But it is actually cold out today, and in Houston that never happens. So I'm like dressing to the nines, not really, but I'm wearing some stuff that I never usually get to wear. So I don't mind hair in a ponytail today just because I am going to be wearing this cute little knit um, headband, which actually I just thought about is gonna be hard to wear my mask if my ears are covered, but. Oh well. Is this even cute? I don't think this is even cute. Okay, hold on. I'll pick out a different hat actually, but yeah, I'm just gonna get ready a little bit. And so I need to go to Old Navy and exchange a few things. And then I also need to, I don't need to, but I'm gonna go to Bath and Body Works, smell a few candles. And um, today, is their Cyber Monday deal. So they're having 40% off the whole store. So I wanna pick up a candle holder actually. Um, and maybe if they have it, one of the little like ornaments, the little Bath Body Works um, striped ornaments, just because if it's 40% off, I think they're $20 cause they're glass. So that's kind of like expensive to me. Um, not worth pay paying full price, but also not worth getting six of them to get them half price. Um, so I might go in today. I think it'd be $12 then, right? If I'm doing my math correctly. Um, so I don't know. We'll see if I get that, but I do want to get a candle holder. That's actually something that I really want to get. So I'll probably do that. And then I'll check out, we have a Ross and we have a, is it a Marshall's or a TJ Maxx? I think it's a Marshall's. Um, I need to pick up my mom some creamer. She gets her keto creamer from um, Marshalls, so if they have any, I'll pick her up some. But I also kind of just want to look and see if they have any Ray done. I did my decorating over the weekend, and um, okay, I really don't even need to put makeup on my face because my mask is going to cover it, but I'm still going to put a little bit on my problem areas. Um, I decorated this weekend with my done and I could use a few more a few more items. I really don't need anything, but if they have anything, I'll see. Um, so I'll definitely take you guys with me to go shop in those stores. And um, I think we have a Starbucks cart, so I might get like a holiday drink. We'll see. And oh, I need to also pick up my brother some socks. Um, my mom gave me money. We usually get like the fuzzy socks from Old Navy every year. So they've been having them like $1 all week, but 
I don't know if they're one dollar anymore, but I think they're only like three or four dollars anyways. So she gave me some money to pick him up, some fuzzy socks, and I think that's everything for the mall. I'm going to put on some uh, chili before I go in the crock pot. Um, and that's going to be my meals for the week at work. Um, I'm going to do like one meal is my chili and the other meal is just like a frozen dinner. So, and then I need to come home and record a video and record a makeup look. So, since I'm doing like um, a video every day of December, I'm pre-recording a ton. So I've been recording like almost two videos a day over the weekend to try and prep, but I'm actually really excited. So you'll probably be seeing this um, on the weekend after I'm recording it. So reminder, it's Monday and I'm gonna finish getting ready and then we're gonna go put the chili in the crock pot. Okay, I wanted to show you guys my outfit since it's never cold here, so I get to wear cold clothes. So I did end up doing the um, little headband. I have this Henley from Old Navy. I have my little Charming Charlie's necklace on. This is from like, I don't even know, I've had this for years. Um, I have some Target jeans on, some Target socks, and then my riding boots. I think these are from JCPenney. I got them last year at their Black Friday sale. And then I'm gonna put on my, it's very, very windy outside. I'm gonna put on this jacket from Old Navy that I got last year. It's like a moto jacket, but it's pink. And then my pink scarf. So I'm gonna do that. I think what I'm gonna do is go to the mall and then come back and make my chili because it said it takes like three hours. What am I doing? It takes three hours to make it. I have to brown it first. So I'm just gonna go and come back. I hope I get, can get back here by like three maybe, so. Currently it is one, if my Fitbit will show me, ah, one nineteen. So we're gonna leave and go to the mall. in uh, Marshalls. Did not expect to do that much. I'll haul it later when I get home, but um, it's 3.41, so I went a little off schedule. I got distracted in Marshalls. I shouldn't have even gone in there. Honestly, I shouldn't have even gone in there. But I did, and I picked up a few things at Bath & Body Works. I just got a candle sleeve and then the little Christmas cookies bath bombs. So those were really cute. I was happy to get those too. They came out, my total came out to $19, which was the same price as the candle holder by itself. So that was good. Um, and yeah, returned my stuff at Old Navy, got a new jacket, so we're gonna head home and make some chili, and I'm gonna eat some late lunch, maybe just a snack, we'll see. So I kind of like laid out my haul for you guys. So this is everything from Marshalls. So the first thing is this bow that I actually got to be the topper on our tree. So I don't know if you can see it over there, but there's our little mini tree that we have in the dining room and this is the bow. How pretty, oh my gosh, in the sun. So that's gonna be pretty. And then I found some scrunchies in the checkout line and there are those like big giant ones. So I just wanted one, uh, a pair of them. So it's $4.99. I found some, okay, so you know I love skinny syrup, but I found this one, it's also sugar free and it's just plain peppermint. I've been looking for a plain peppermint one because they have a peppermint bark one from uh, Skinny Syrup, but I don't want it to have chocolate in it. I don't like chocolate in my coffee, so got that. That was 
And then I found this little gnome guy. It's a Rayda gnome and he's, um, he says Holly and he was a 9.99. So he thought he was super cute. I also found this Merry Christmas sign. This was also 9.99. I found this other Merry Christmas sign. I liked how big it was. Um, it was $12.99. Let me tell you guys, I kind of like blacked out in Marshalls. I just like got a bunch of stuff. I don't know. Um, I actually needed one of these um, mounts. So I hope you can turn it sideways so that way I can use it to vlog in the car. Um, I got this cute little puppy uh, bag because I got so much stuff it was easier to carry it around the mall on that. Um, and then I got this little Jingle Bell tree for $7.99 just to decorate with. Um, and then here's the jacket that I got from Old Navy. So it's just like a little fluffy Sherpa jacket. Um, I don't have one of these that zips all the way down. So it's like easier to put on and off. And it's just like a simple jacket, very soft. So I got this one, I think it was $19.99. Um, I returned a jacket and then I got this one. And so they were kind of like the same price. And then from Bath & Body Works, um, this is Cyber Monday, keep in mind. So everything was 40% off. I got the last one of these in the store. It was holding a candle <laughs> in it for display. And then I just like snatched it up. So it was uh, $15.95 and I got it for $9.99. And then also the last one in the store, I got the pack of Mary Cookie Bath Fizzers. So I'm very excited about these. Um, this was originally uh, $12.95. I got it for $7.99. I'm gonna open it up and see how it smells actually. Okay, so this is what they look like on the inside. They just look like regular bath bombs. Um, and then let's sniff them. I'm gonna get my hands all dirty for this. They're actually really nice looking. Um, decent size. They smell like cookies, but also like chamomile kind of. They smell like tea or like, um, I don't know. Not quite exactly Mary Cookie. Like I have the uh, Mary Cookie hand uh, hand cream. It doesn't smell like that. So, but it does smell very sweet. It just like has like a tea um, scent to it also. So that's the haul that I got. <laughs> to be packed for lunches. And with that, I'm gonna call it a night. <laughs> Go ahead and pack all my lunch. I'm gonna clean up the dining room. I've been decorating like all weekend. You guys should be seeing decorating videos soon. And I am gonna go to bed. <laughs> Good morning, guys. It's currently December 1st. I'm at work and I have my mask down because I'm drinking my coffee. I put some um, peppermint skinny syrup in it today and it tastes really good. So, and I dressed up today because my boss and teammates are in from uh, really a lot of different places. Um, they're in town and so we're having a few meetings throughout the day. So, but I dressed up and I, dre I bundled up because it's like 30 degrees outside and it never gets this cold in Houston. So I was really excited. And so I wore my sweater and I have a scarf on. I'll show you the full fit later in the bathroom and show you my, um, I'm wearing some like patterned houndstooth pants and my little booties and I felt really cute today. So, but yeah, I'm gonna drink my coffee and I probably won't see you guys again today because I'm not really doing anything interesting. I'm just, just working. So have a great day. So I got home. It's still Tuesday, December 1st, and I got a Bath & Body Works order. I ordered two online, well no, this one's an online exclusive candle and this one was just new. Um, I ordered these on the 20th. They were $14.50 and then I used a 10 off of 30 coupon, so they were technically $10. So same as the candle day price. So I got salted caramel. The notes are... Roasted chestnuts, caramelized sugar, and spiced rum. And you could smell this when I took it out of its like packaging. It smells so good, even my dad liked it. And then I got chocolate grams, 
It is milk, chocolate, graham, graham cracker, caramel swirl, and vanilla extract. This one's not very strong, but it just smells like chocolate covered graham crackers or like chocolate covered Ritz crackers. It kind of gives me the same vibes as pumpkin peanut brittle. And then I got a free gift with purchase. So I got the Christmas cookies body cream since it's an online exclusive. And then to bring my total to 30 so that I could get the 10 off 30, I got a bag with another gift tag. So I'll probably use this for a gift. So that's everything and I'm gonna call it a night and uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Hello guys, it's currently Wednesday the 2nd. It is 9.20 p.m. I just got home from work. It was a very, very, very busy day at work today, so I did not film anything, but I just got home to another few packages. Um, I ordered these a few weeks ago. It's actually from an Etsy shop here um, in Houston, and I ordered them just because it was kind of like an hour drive so to pick them up, so I ordered from her Etsy but I'll go ahead and show you guys what I got. So this is so cute, I can't. So it's a faux whipped cream topper for your mug. So I'll show you it on one of the Ray Dunn mugs. But I thought it was just so cute with a little peppermint on top and the little straws and a little, I guess it's a little hot cocoa like foam sticker. And she put glitter all over it, so cute. So I got this for <laughs> just to put on a little mug. And then she also had these mini rolling pins. I just thought they were so adorable. And I wanted to support local businesses. She posted in our um, local Houston Ray Dunn page that she made these. So I went ahead and bought me some, but they're so cute. I'll show you guys her Etsy shop is Forever Tiffany's Boutique. She does a lot of different stuff too. Like she does um, stuff with this vinyl on, um, ooh, let me focus on different items like she has a book stack and a few different things and she has fall items and just like regular decor so if you're looking for something like i think this is just the cutest thing i've ever seen so i'm so excited to have this i honestly don't know where i'm gonna put it but i could not get over how cute it was <laughs> so that's my little haul and i think i'm just gonna take a shower and go to bed because i am so tired i stayed up late last night editing videos to go up um, since I'm doing one video every day of the week up, wait, every day leading up to Christmas. So, um, yeah, that's everything for today, for Wednesday. I'm gonna go to bed. I'm so tired, you guys. I will see you tomorrow. Hello, guys. Today is Thursday, December 3rd, and I have my Christmas mask on today at work. I just wanted to show you guys how cute it is. So it has little like um, hot cocoa. There's this little Santa mug, gingerbread man, peppermint stick. There's a little plate that says cookies for Santa, some sugar cookies. I just thought it was so cute. And um, I bought this headband from Etsy actually. And um, she makes, I'll link her Etsy down below because I love these headbands. They are a godsend for work when I have to wear masks for 12 hours a day. Um, but I got a green one so it could go with all of my Christmas masks. And you know what? I'm gonna actually show you guys the rest of the Christmas masks that I got off of Etsy. Hold on, give me a sec. Okay, so I have this one that has candy canes and snowflakes on it. And oh, I dropped it. <laughs> and the other side is red. And then this one that says ho, ho, ho on it. And the other side is black. I like these, but they're not very comfortable. They're like not the best material. They're not very soft. Um, so I only wear them at work when I can um, do the tie up on my button because this strap is like not the best quality and it doesn't feel that great on your ears. But anyways, I thought I would show you guys my Christmas mask and also like I don't have anything interesting going on today at work um, or today in general on Thursday. So yeah, that's probably it. And I'm still debating whether tomorrow for candle day to go before work at like 7 a.m. or to go after work at like 8, 15 p.m. I get off at 8 p.m. before they close at nine. Cause I don't think there's not, I don't really need any of the candles that are like the um, exclusive to candle day candles that everyone's gonna buy up first. So I feel like it'll be fine if I just go at 8 p.m. Cause I feel like getting up an hour earlier is just gonna be 
not good as I've also not been getting a lot of sleep this week at work so not at work sleep before work um, so yeah I think I'm gonna go tomorrow after work to shop candle day and I will try to vlog I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get video in the store if there's gonna be a lot of people probably not um, but I will definitely have a candle day haul coming at you guys very soon too so I mean it'll probably be up before this vlog actually so yeah but that's everything for Thursday and I'll probably see you guys tomorrow hello guys it is Friday December 4th it is candle day and it's almost 8 p.m. I'm literally about to leave work and go straight to the Bath and Body Works by my work which is about 15 minutes away and I really hope they still have Christmas candles. I hope they have something. Um, I don't really have high expectations just because seeing people's videos today, I feel like there's not gonna be a lot left. So I'm a little scared. Um, I don't wanna, I don't know. I might just have to pick up filler candles and go like replace them some other day. But yeah, I'm about to head over there. I figured I'd record inside while I have some good lighting um, instead of out in the dark in my car. So I'm about to head over there and I guess I'll, uh, update you guys if I find stuff, so yeah. I don't know what just happened. I blacked out in Bath and Body Works. And I just, I bought nine, I bought nine candles and I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. I'll see you guys at home. Okay, so I'm literally at home right now, sitting on my floor. I cleaned off all of my candles, I like sanitized them, I smelled them all because I kind of like got really confused in the store. So I went at 8.20 p.m. because I got off of work at 8, I drove to my store, I got in line, there was like five people in line or like five, it was like a father and daughter, two sisters, like it was like groups of people but there was like five groups ahead of me. So it wasn't like a very long line and it was a pretty small store. I think it was just a Bath and Body Works. But there was like, it seemed like there was a lot of people in the store and they were like reaching over everything and like it was very crowded and people kept taking off their masks to smell stuff. And like, I, it was very overwhelming and they did not have like anything left. They had a lot of like the summer and spring candles left and they even had like a table full of like returns almost you could tell because they were they had like last year's Christmas candles they had a few it was literally less than 10 candles on that return section um there was a few Christmas candles from last year and then there was a pomegranate lemonade I'm gonna spoil it because I got it um and I really wanted that one so I got that one um and then two online exclusives champagne apple and honey the candle and then almond blossom so I was really surprised to see those um I didn't pick them up but I was really surprised to see those they must have been returns and then um there was some vampire bloods left over from Halloween there were some fall candles um but they really did not have barely any Christmas candles left and that was disappointing because I really wanted Christmas candles so I went ahead and I bought nine um and I'm gonna bring five with me tomorrow and I'm gonna check out some stores tomorrow and see if they have anything. Um, I, I'm keeping four that I bought today and I'm bringing five with me tomorrow to try and exchange them. Um, and if I don't find anything, then I'm just not gonna bother with it, but I'm gonna try tomorrow and see if maybe my store's near me, cause I went to a store near my work. Um, if my stores near me have what I'm looking for. So hopefully they do and I can exchange them. That was like really disappointing and like very overwhelming and I did not enjoy that experience. But at least there wasn't like an hour wait. <laughs> well, you can't even have an hour wait at 8.30 p.m. But yeah, I drove by it and there was a line and I was like, really, 8.30, 8.30 p.m. and there's still a line? I'm disappointed, but I'm not surprised. So I'm gonna go tomorrow, I think at 5 a.m. I really don't wanna get up there early, but I think I'm just gonna do it and go exchange them and hopefully they are gonna restock because I was talking to the associate in the line and she was saying if there's candles and if the candles that you want aren't in there like we don't have them in stock just buy something else and you can exchange them and I was like wow I'm really surprised that y'all even still have candles like do you have more in the back for the next three days and she was like I hope we get another shipment because there there's that's all we have and I was like 
Really? They had like a third of the store. It was very empty. So I'm like very confused as to how they don't have stuff for the rest of the weekend. Unless she was just like told to say that and like lie basically. That they have to, they can't like, maybe they can't restock until tomorrow or until tonight after they close. I don't know. Um, but I'm not going back to that store. So I'm going to a different store. And then I might go to my mall cause that opens at 10. So there's a standalone store that's a white barn and a Bath and Body Works that opens at 5 a.m. And then a uh, Bath and Body Works by itself, which is actually an outlet Bath and Body Works in my mall. So that might have some cool candles if I go there and that opens at 10. So we'll see what I can find. Um, I'm gonna try and stay under 10 candles. So, yep, that is it for Saturday. I'm very tired. I'm gonna go to sleep and uh, get up early, so wish me luck. Hello guys, it's currently 9 a.m. on December 5th. Yeah, Saturday, December 5th. And I have my returns at Bath & Body Works and I'm gonna go to the mall. They open at 10, so let's go. call that a total success they had so many candles left at this store in the mall they had a lot of the different the new collections for candle day they had stuff left they had a lot of christmas candles left they had like literally everything that i wanted and more and i was so happy and they were being really good about um like how many people they let in and it wasn't super crowded and i didn't feel like people were like crowding me and breathing on me and pulling their masks down to sniff candles and they even had the um, reusable bags still left so once you checked out they put one in your bag and yeah that was like the best experience so that was really good um i'm gonna see you guys at home i'm probably gonna eat some call eat some coffee <laughs> it's too early it's not even that early drink some coffee and eat and then i'll come back and show you guys what i got i'm back home now i had my coffee and my tis the season mug i had a breakfast taco and i just recorded my candle day video my candle day haul video um, so that should actually be going up before this, but in case you didn't see it, here is all of the candles that I got from the two candle day uh, events that I went to. I also got two online. I got um, butter rum eggnog and vanilla bean marshmallow. So very excited to have all of these. Um, I will link my candle day video in the eye up above. Yeah. Okay. I had to remember what it was called. Um, but yeah, this is everything that I got for candle day. I'm super excited. Okay, this is a little sneak peek of everything that I decorated for Christmas, but anyways. Um, I'm super happy about everything that I got today, It and it made Friday worth it almost. Um, so very happy about my candle day experience. Um, yeah, it was, it was overall positive. I think Friday was very disappointing, and then Saturday was very not disappointing it was exceeded my expectations so that was really good and i'm happy that i that i was one of the lucky ones who got an online order to go through um i'm very grateful for that i'm so sorry if you did not have your online order go through and you didn't want to go in stores that's not right of them to try and force people to go in stores during a pandemic i feel like that's just horrible but yeah so that's everything for candle day and for saturday i'm probably not going to do anything else today honestly maybe i'll bake uh, we'll see if I'll bake some like little mini apple pies. I have some apples left over from Thanksgiving, but um, I think that's everything. I think I'm gonna go shower and um, just have like a really chill day, play some Animal Crossing. But yeah, this is probably the end of the week one vlog for Vlogmas. Um, thank you guys so, so much for watching this. I hope that you enjoyed kind of just being relaxed and chill with me for a long um like vlog video and i will see you guys next week for vlogmas week two i hope that you enjoyed let me know down below something you did interesting for the first week of december did you go to uh candle day did you participate in it online let me know down below but thank you guys so so much for watching and i will see you guys in the next video bye